even if you repeat the same sin 70 times a day and you attempt to make a sincere tawbah, that you're not considered to be musir, a persistent sinner. They mention that in particular in the books. You do your very best. A sincere repentance means that you don't ever go back to that sin again. But even if you go back to that sin again, that you make an intention in that moment when you commit that sin, even if you have, there's a high level probably you're going to do that same sin 10 minutes later. In that moment, repent. And in the next 10 minutes, repent. And you won't do that sincerely except at some point Allah Ta'ala will remove you from that condition. Right? So don't let the fact that you're weak and you continually fall into that sin repent you, prevent you from repenting. That even if there's things that you're struggling with in your deen, that you know the next day that you're going to commit that same sin, and that morning repent, before, during, and after. And if you're sincere in that, that eventually Allah Ta'ala will take you out of that, if you're sincere. And that's why you can never despair, ever, 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 ever despair. To me, one of the most beautiful aspects of our deens, Allah has made despairing from His mercy a major sin. It's a sin to despair. And so never despair. Repent in return. Repent in return. And that without doubt, a true repentance is you never return. But even if you return, that you keep repenting. You keep repenting. Hopes that Allah Ta'ala will eventually, because you don't know. Maybe you'll take a lot, your last breath and you died in that state of repentance.